In this world, wondrous creatures, dragons, and wizards all seek to live in balance. Spellcasters from across the lands venture to join magical guilds, mastering all forms of sorcery. Divinish Magia, Grimshade, the Protector's Guild, and more all seek to offer a home to those in need. These guilds compete again in the Grand Magic Games to become the paramount wizarding establishment. After an evil Grand Master sought to take over the city of Atlantide, heroes of the four guilds joined together to defeat him and cast all evil wizards from the realm, banishing the darkness for now. Welcome to Fairy Tale Origin. to be around here somewhere. <sighs> Milk bar? Okay, now just to take a Beginning look to seem hopeless. Sun. I'm never going to find Nyx. <laughs> Nyx! There oh. you are. Oh, why, hello there, Miss Lofo. Oh, how are you doing today? Not very good, Nyx. Not very good. Oh, no. Did someone forget to fill up your, your monthly supply of milk? But, no, that this has nothing to do with milk. Uh, oh, let me guess. Jakey let uh, forgot to lock the gate to the, all the Olivers again, and now they're all out, out and about again. Is that right? W wait, are they? Wait. But, uh, no, no, that is not what this is about either. This is about you, Nix. Me? Uh, okay. Did I do something? I'm not sure. I feel as if you did. Well, I cannot be sure. I need to hear it from you. Hear from me? Uh, okay. What do you need to hear from me? I took a visit to that village you helped a while back. Oh, that's surprising. Yes, and it turns out they are not doing so well. <gasps> that, that that can't be true. I was I helped them all. I made sure no ba there was no bandits left. There certainly weren't any bandits. They were all dead, as were the people. No. The villagers. That can't be. I was sure, but they all, were, they were all perfectly fine when I left the village. Nothing was bothering them anymore. Or when I left. Whatever happened, it happened shortly after. Or worse. Worse. What could possibly be worse than this? This is a catastrophe the, already. Uh, the bodies were reduced to skeletons by this time. All of them. Oh my god, who could have done such a thing? I... I have a few ideas. Okay, tell me, what's your ideas? Well... Nix, did you have anything to do with the deaths of these people? What? I'm offended, why would I do such a thing? I'm a member of the Protector Skill, we protect people. Don't, I don't, don't know, the evidence adds up, Nix. Something is off about you. I can feel it. That's, everyone not says told that. the truth about everything. I have been... I I have not lied to you once. Once about since I joined this protector guild. Sure, I have something in my past I'm not happy to speak about, but that's all. I guess there's the 
past you keep being afraid of, there is... you just seem off. Have you ever Don't been know in... if I can trust you anymore, Nyx. I guess you won't leave, leave this time until I give you the answers you want, is that right? I suppose so. Fine, but... You know, before that, can we just grab a glass of milk? I feel like I'm go we're gonna need that. This is not a time for milk! You, I mean, I wouldn't mind milk, but... You know, yeah, I was just about to say, because, um... What kind... You denying milk? That would be some... Maybe I should ask if you were the real of or not. This is not funny, Nix. Sorry, sorry. You know... <laughs> I uh, don't know why, but... Anyway... I think you've done something. Just here. I don't know what I would have done. Anyway, here. Yes, thank you, thank you. So, okay. What did happen at the village? Okay, so you see, I came to the village and met met with the village chief there. You know, you know, nothing. They told me they had problems with with bandits and then they've been stealing from them and stealing from them and all that and plundering their village for food and all other kind of resources. Yes. As the job description says. If you remember, so mm -hmm. they asked me to help them, help them make sure the bandits would leave them alone and never, and make sure that nothing could bother them again. That was the quest, and I did exactly what they, what the quest and they told me to do. Now nothing will bother them ever again. Uh, I'm feeling dizzy. Nah, you're probably just fine. You're probably just a little bit confused about what I mean. So let me tell you. Yes, wait, I, what do you mean? I you mean, say nothing is going to problem them. They seem to have pro problems. I mean, do skeletons normally complain about things? Wait, you exactly you killed them? <laughs> exactly. I mean, they never. Well, it's that. Well, yeah, they said I should make sure nothing would ever bother them again, and now nothing will ever bother them again. And you're supposed to to, to protect the pe people. I am. I protected them from the bandits. As said, they asked me to do that. I just did it in a creative way, you might say. You're going to pay for this, Nix. Oh, I'm probably will one. Oh. I probably will one day. But don't you feel like taking a nap you... first? What did you do to this milk? Oh, you... nothing. You might just be tired from all the questing and all the, the fighting you've been going through. You, you know. Oh, yeah. did I mean? Uh, now let's get you to Abraham. Wow, this was easier than I thought it would be. Wakey, wakey, rise and shine. Enjoy what? your catnap. Catnap? What is happening here? Where am I? What? You. Who are you? It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance, Mr. Lightfire. My name is Abraham, and currently you're, uh, uh, my humble abode. Yeah, we'll call it that. Uh, how did I even get here? Where is Nyx? Oh, uh, I'm sure he'll turn up eventually, but that's not important. What is important is the fact that you're here. I can finally talk to you. See, uh, since you're a guild leader and I'm not exactly allowed to wander the streets, uh, it's kind of hard to get a private conversation with you without resorting to means uh, like this. I, I, I don't think it would be. You just... Uh, I can't move. Oh, uh, yeah. Why can't I move? Magic chains. They, uh, they stop you from casting any spells and... Uh, they keep you like locked in place. Plus, they're a wee bit fashionable. Do you like them? <laughs> I don't think that I like them. This well, is not ideal. If you wanted to talk to me, you could just set an appointment or talk to me like a normal person. But you remember the part where I said I can't exactly wander the streets. Why can you not wander these streets? Oh, come on. You're a protector. You're a smart boy. Put two and two together. You're some sort of criminal. Oh, there he goes. Good job. Very well. What is it that you want? Oh, I'll cut straight to the chase. I want you to have a word with the Magic Council. Would like you to disband. 
disband the Magic Council. More accurately, uh, convince your fellow Magic Council members to retire. Man, you showed up like a, a year, a few months too late. Yep, quite frankly, I should have showed up all right when Grandmaster Jonathan kicked the bucket. Yeah, there was and, not uh, much of a council. <sighs> yeah, should have been there. But unfortunately, I was a bit preoccupied with some other means. Other means? Oh, those means aren't important right now. <sighs> now, what do you say? Get rid of the old magic council. Make way for something new, something more interesting, something a bit more stable. The yeah? magic council is there for a reason. Yeah, and it's not doing a good job of that reason. It's helping protect Atlantide. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, sorry. I, I really shouldn't laugh, but uh, yeah, they're not doing that. The only one who is doing that is you. The others help as well. There was threats that they may have sort of caused, but still. Yeah, no. The whole dragons incident, A, shouldn't have happened. B, was caused per future version of a, a current Magic Council member. Yes. C, what if it wasn't, you know, solely here that it happened? What if Maybe it happened somewhere else. Who would care? No one. <sighs> Things are always happening other places. Exactly. The folk, could you put a little more emotion into it? You know, I want. I want to. See, this is getting good. What is? Hello there. Yes. Yes. In the flesh, so to speak. What is with your face? Wow. That's a bit rude. Uh, uh, and your horns and your rippling abdominals. As Abraham said, you're a protector. You can put two and two together. You're some sort of devil? Ding, ding, ding. Give the cat a prize. Oh, he... Hey, hey, great, great. My prize is freedom, right? Oh, uh, <laughs> not, not quite. Uh, no. The prize is a uh, good job. You figured it out. Although you do get bonus points, because most people tend to kill me a demon off the bat. <sighs> so you've been in the Protector's Guild this whole time? Pretty much. You were. It was really easy, too, I must say, in convincing you all. all. I just had to put up a little act, you know. Oh, Master Lofo, it is a great honor to meet the great Master Lofo. I've heard so much about you. You. Hmm. You. It was really easy. I'm going easy. to pay for this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what the last couple of people who has tried to do that to me said. And lo and behold, I'm still here. <laughs> this explains a lot about the magics you've been using. Oh, yeah, that. Oh, yeah. I should have seen this sooner. And what? You're working with this Abraham? More or less. First off, it's Abraham. Second off, it's. Oh. More like a business deal. Yeah. I have what kind of business. Well, I supply him with certain lacma, and in exchange, he helps me wherever he can, such as kidnapping god slayers. Yeah. God slayers, plural. Well, I mean, I'm surprised that you haven't heard of me sooner. Considering you did have that chat with Michael Wait. and Lucas. You're that guy. Oh, wow. He is smart. He does. If not if not a little bit slow, maybe, but at least he, he puts things together. You hadn't heard from them in a long time. What did you do with them? Well, uh, I kidnapped him, tied him down, questioned him, tried to convince him to, you know, help me disband the Magic Council. They said no. So, uh, yeah. Huh. Oh, yeah. I mean, you say so, yeah, like it, it answers <laughs> what happened to them. No, that just, you just let them well, go? Is that what this is? No, no. I mean, you see these like my other side of you. You do? 
can you sense the energy within them? They are kind of light based. I do. Yeah, they are. Uh... Let's just say that the other god slayers didn't get out of here unscathed. <laughs> I oh. see. I wish I could have been there to see that. That would have been a quite. I give it. I bet it was quite the show. Oh, I mean, I. Depending on Mr. Lofo's answers right here, you might get to see that. Ooh, goody, goody, goody. Look, I, I get it. The Magic Council is not perfect, but... <laughs> not not perfect. Not perfect. <laughs> ah, you bring the city. The city has been in more chaos in the last few months than it was the previous year. Yeah, and I love it. No offense, Abraham, of course, but that's just how I am. <sighs> to be fair, I... Whilst it wasn't perfect under Grandmaster Jonathan's rule, is that the correct term? I guess that it's is. Still, uh, still, uh, Grandmaster Jonathan was still better than the current Magic Council. That says quite a lot, considering the Grandmaster Jonathan's plans. I think you're wrong. I mean, currently the Magic <sighs> Council, the currently the Magic Council is currently made up of a um, prideful, arrogant. Arrogant dra celestial dragon slayer guy who thinks he's the strongest in all the land, and two, he has his own problems. But two, he means and a, well. A person who is a who has a bit of an alcoholic problem, problem, and another guy who is well, and his brother who is, for lack of better term, um, he is yeah, he seems to have some issues of his own accord. And then there is oh yeah, let's not forget the carnival, the fu the fun of the bunch, but. Was, they are far from stable. And did you know that Miss Flurry has been lying about a lot of things? Uh, that is to be expected, but they are helping the people. And then there's the protectors, which is all a bunch of lollygagging, cookie-loving, loving peace lovers that barely gets anything done. Excuse me? You're excused. But, no, 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 just, we help people. <laughs> Oh yeah. What people? You don't <laughs> you help said... the homelessness crisis. You don't help the economic crisis. You don't actually care about anyone who isn't non-magic or a criminal. You know how I know that? Because I plant Lagava all over the sea. I know exactly what's going on every single second of every single yeah. day. I mean, for and a lot. I'll tell you something right now, Mister Lofo. Nothing is changing. Yeah. I mean, for the love Nothing. of it, for the love of everything, Lofo, you sent me to save a village. Me of all people! <laughs> yeah, I'm really surprised that you didn't see him see through him sooner. Doesn't he, he, he can hide it, but it's not exactly difficult to figure out. Hmm. I didn't even put Explains on my explains all of these stinky comments. Yeah, I'm so, yeah, ex although I will give her. She was onto me right from the get go. Clever girl, that one. Yes. So what do you you expect me to just walk out of here and disband the magic council? Precisely. You think I have the power to do that? I think I'm not you have a grandmaster. Convince people. I think you have the power to show them, you know, the light, quote unquote. Uh, he is very funny, very funny. <laughs> Look, you you've spoken about the other members of the council. How would I convince people like that? This is the most I can do to just hold it together. Well, you know what they say: there is power in the people. And the people, well, of Atlantide, they're not really fond of the Magic Council. Don't get me wrong, they love you. They, they, they love the little adorable kitty cat that thinks he can uh, run the country. Kind of, I am not adorable. I mean, yeah, you are right. He is kind of the face of the Magic Council, isn't he? he. Kind of like a mascot. <laughs> yeah. That is not funny. I am going to get out of this chair. He... Ah... Sorry. <laughs> Mr. Lofo, it's quite obvious that you cannot escape. At least not on your own. And, uh, well. You have pretty much one option here. Say yes. It's alright. The Protector's Guild will break in here and save me any moment now. You mean like, right. um, let's see, last I checked, Jakey was on a personal mission. This is true. Brian is no longer part of the Protector's Guild. This is true. Kay is going through her edgy phase, which I must say, probably one of my better works yet. This is true. And who does that leave? 
B-boy. Yeah. And even if he came here, do you honestly think he has a chance against... Uh, not me, little, let alone Abraham here too. I mean, what, apart he's bad, he would barely have a chance against both of us, but together? Oh, that would be... A what shortcoming power point. does Abraham wield? Oh, it's a beautiful kind of spell called memory make. Hmm. You manipulate Anything... minds. No, not quite. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, technically I can access that power. I've seen someone access that power, therefore I can replicate it. Yeah. Oh, Any and... spell I've seen. So thanks to the Grand Magic Games, I have a lot of spells stored in this old noggin of mine. Mm -hmm. And if, you, yeah. and if you're one, and if you're still wondering how I reflected you reflected your death magic, I didn't. I just spoke it back to you. You see, I possess a little certain magic called soul word magic. Hmm. I you, see. Yeah. Please tell, do you do you need an explanation for that, or do you know what that is? Uh, go ahead, explain it. You already want to. I can tell. Ah, I love it when people give me the time. <clears throat> so you know that Devin is met. So you know Eden, as you probably called him when we first introduced? Yes, is of course. Yeah, how he can just imagine things that happen? Well, I work on the same basis. Other I just have to utter the word instead. Good, good. So, we have a copycat of Eden and a copycat of Grandmaster Jonathan trying to, you know, do their own thing, huh? Well, I'd say he, he's more like the one who just takes the magic and puts his own flair on it. I just uh, speak it. And also, uh, a couple of things. Hmm. Whilst we are trying to do our own thing, it's not quite the same as a copycat of Eden and Grandmaster Jonathan. Because, uh, you know, we actually get things done. More or less. I certainly hope so. Okay. Cannot make you any promises about the council. I cannot swear to disband them. I am Lofo of the Protectors Guild, and I will protect the city, whatever it takes. All of the city. Ooh. It's a shame. Because you've sworn to protect the city before, and just not doing a good job of it now. So let's just get this over and done with, shall we? It would we? be worse off without us. Let me. <laughs> you oh, say I, that. This is gonna. What I've got in mind. This is gonna be good. Ah! What are you doing? Oh, my life. Your uh, magic. Uh, you're taking the magic? Siphoning it, to be exact. No. Don't worry, you'll still be left with plenty of magic to spare. I'm just getting a taste. You're taking the god slaying magic? Precisely. No, 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 you don't know what you're doing. This is a bad plan. Stop um, whatever you're exactly doing. What I'm doing. Stop what you're doing. <laughs> oh, no, please do go on. Uh, it's not like there's anything is... wrong here. There is something very wrong here. I just managed to gain control, and you're going to break it all. That's no concern of mine. You don't understand. The god within me, he is dangerous. I mean, isn't all gods dangerous in a nutshell? Most of yes. them, yeah. But this one, he seeks to balance life and death. Oh, then Which that is bad. That doesn't concern me, really. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm fine. Let but him out, why don't you? You want to protect the people, but... Mm, because... <sighs> yeah, you're not a concern to me. Whatever is going on with you right now, let's dial it up to 11, shall we? No! Stop it! Ah! It's too much! This is too much magic! Ah! How can I stop this? The radiant beam! Oh, ah! It's prison of light! No! Ah! No! No, stop it! Stop it! 